According to the book of Daniel, in the Hebrew Bible, this is in the Tanakh, the Hebrew Bible, a greatly praised nation, an ummah led by a leader highly beloved to God, will come and conquer the fourth beast of Daniel's visions. He, the prophet Daniel had a vision of four beasts. These are symbols. The fourth beast was interpreted as the Roman Empire by the most authoritative Jewish exegetes, the Babylonians, the Persians, the Greeks, and the Romans. Now Daniel also said that one of the Roman emperors will fight and oppress the monotheistic believers and commit an act of unimaginable blasphemy. And I believe that when you look at the evidence, this emperor was clearly Hadrian, who fought against and expelled all the Jews and the Jewish Christians, the people of Tawhid, from Jerusalem and placed a statue of Zeus on the Temple Mount. However, Daniel says that this beast will be killed by this coming great nation in 1,335 years. It actually gives a time, an exact date. Hadrian became emperor on August 11th, 117 of the Common Era. The prophecy says that during the Roman period, a powerful and holy prophet called the Bar Anash in Aramaic, the son of man, will come with a nation of saints who will definitively end the Roman Empire, the fourth beast. Now the Christians say, this is us. The Christians claim this is our nation. But Hellenistic Christianity, starting with Constantine, converted the Roman Empire. They did not conquer it. They became an extension of the fourth beast. By 381 of the Common Era, Trinitarian Christianity became the official religion of the Roman Empire. So now Kufr and Shirk that had corrupted the message of Isa alayhi salam was all over the empire. And the true Mawahidun, the true monotheists, the Jews and the Unitarian or Ebionite Christians were being marginalized and persecuted. And then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala raised the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam with the pure Tawheed, the Tawheed of the Prophets of old. He is the Prophet of the Abrahamic Restoration. One by one, the major cities of Byzantium, the Eastern Roman Empire fell to the Muslims. This was the great universal monotheistic ummah that Daniel foresaw in his vision. And on May 25th, 1453, Constantinople, the, the, the city of Constantine was conquered by the Ottomans. And this was officially, this officially and definitively ended the Roman Empire. This was exactly 1,335 1, years after Hadrian became emperor. It's amazing. August 11th, 117 to May 29, 1453 is 1,335 years, 9 months and 18 days.